I had to hear about the birds and the bees from my free-loving hippie mom. She sat on my bed one day. She says, celestial rainbow. Making love to a man is like a beautiful rose. Each petal is beautiful and graceful in its own right. It is time for you to give a man your rose. I was 13. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of thought maybe my flowers should just blossom a little bit more before the petals just got ripped off. Just me? I had a hard time convincing her that I wasn't going to give my rose up until I got married. And I did. Yes, thank you for applying for my virginity. But I'm divorced now. Yes, and I get to get her back with that type of luck. Hey, Ma, went out on a date last night, gave the guy the whole bouquet. Gonna hold a special next week. Buy one dozen, get one rose bush for free. She's not talking about flowers anymore, is she? <laughs> well, enough about my parents. I uh, have actually gained a lot of weight recently, and I think it has something to do with um, eating. <laughs> really not sure. Here's the thing. I didn't know I had a problem till I got kicked out of the hometown buffet. <laughs> really. Here's what happened. The manager comes up to me and... Is, and he escorts me outside. He says, ma'am, eat as much and as often as you like. But we do not appreciate you eating off of other people's plates. <laughs> where we draw the line. But here's a, I didn't know, did you guys know, if you get kicked out of one hometown buffet, you're banned from the mall? Yes, they are. They have bodyguards out in the front with those little earpieces and the microphones. And so the next time I went, I come walking up and they immediately get on one of those things and you hear, <coughs> we have a code heifer in the front, code heifer in the front to you, copy. <coughs> copy code heifer, take her by, down by any means necessary, but do not use pepper spray. Try to distract her with a pie. <laughs> I'm someone who does not discriminate against pies, let me tell you. Okay. <laughs> 